Hey guys, so being that it is the Victoria's Secret Fashion Show tomorrow, I decided to do a hair and makeup look for you guys. So starting with the makeup, I'm using my L'Oreal True Match a foundation and the Kabuki brush from Sigma and just buffing this into my skin. To get that nice Victoria's Secret glow, I'm using the NYX HD Concealer Photogenic in CW02 and just putting this on all the areas that I want to highlight and then just using a small elf stippling brush to blend that all in together and just doing going over it and stippling it so that it looks like a nice highlight underneath my eyes and on the bridge of my nose and then I'm just going over all of it in the L'Oreal True Match Mineral Powder. I'm going in and filling in my brows and trying to make them look as natural as possible and I'm using my brow bar to go. I don't want to make them look too fake and then just to keep my lips nice and moisturized since we will be putting lip stuff on I'm using my EOS lip Balm. I'm going to this elf palette and taking this nice tan color that's a matte color and using a blending brush to just blend this into my crease. This is just going to make the rest of the colors blend nicer. And then I'm taking this other color that reminds me of hot chocolate. It's like a medium brown and just putting this on top more so on the outer corner and on the lower lash line. And then I'm taking this really pretty bright gold color and putting this all over just patting this with a brush all over the lid. I'm then mixing that same color with a lighter champagne color and using this on my inner tear duct and then using that champagne color on my upper brow bone. I'm then moving back into that hot chocolate like color and just touching up on the crease and outer corner to deepen up the crease a little bit more. And then I'm going in with my eyelash curler and curling my lashes to put on some mascara. I'm using the L'Oreal Manga Lashes Mascara and just putting this on and then I'm going to be doing fake lashes later on but you guys can skip that and just put on a second or third coat. This mascara I find is one of my new favorites so it really lengthens and thickens up the lashes and I'm putting it on my lower lashes as well. I'm then going into my NYX matte bronzer and this is like my favorite bronzer to contour with and Victoria's Secret Angels always have like the perfect contoured face so I'm just contouring out my cheekbones around my hairline, my nose and my chin. I'm then going in with NYC's Prospect Pink Blush and I find this is just the perfect baby pink blush for a Victoria's Secret Angel look. And then like I said before, I'm just going in and putting on my fake lashes. You guys can skip this step, but the Victoria's Secret Angels are definitely wearing fake lashes. So then for the lips, I wanted to keep it nice and natural, so I'm going in with my lip liner by Annabelle and it's in the color Java and I'm just filling in my lips with this. And then I'm going to go in with the Gerard Cosmetics Lipstick in Nude and this is a more mattifying nude so I'm putting that all over my lips and then I'm going back in again with my Gerard Cosmetics Lip Gloss in Nude and just putting this over top since they always have like a baby pink or nude lip color, I wanted to keep it nice and natural. So now of course moving on to hair, I have my Bellamy hair extensions in and I'll leave Leave the code and stuff down below for what extensions they are but you guys can skip extensions even if you have short hair and I'm just putting some heat protecting in my hair you guys can still get these beachy waves with or without extensions I'm just using a one inch curling iron that I took the clamp off of but you guys could also use a one inch curling wand um, I just wanted to keep it so that it was the same thickness throughout the entire wand I don't want it to be thinner at the bottom and I'm just curling away from my face and holding it for about eight to ten seconds and then letting go you want it to be a little bit curlier at the start because we're going to be fluffing it out and brushing it. Also make sure that when you switch to the other side you're still curling away from your face. So just flip sides and curl away from the face and continue to do that all the way up until you get to the front and you're going to want to curl and frame pieces a little bit wavier around your face as well. Then just go ahead and brush out your hair a little bit and fluff it out with your fingers and your hair is all set. Cause darling I'm a nightmare dressed like a daydream. So it's gonna be forever. So that is it for my Victoria's Secret hair and makeup tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed and let me know down below which angel is your favorite. I'll see you guys all tomorrow.